Okie dokie. In this problem, they give us the same information we saw back in 1.12a. So what we'll do is use that information to set up an equation. They say that n is proportional to the product of z and r, meaning n is equal to k, the constant, times z times r. So k, z, r. Then they say n is inversely proportional to d. So on top of what we already have constructed, we will just uh, incorporate the constant d, or the variable d, into this equation. So inversely proportional, meaning we throw d in the denominator. Then they give us values for d and n and the product of z and r. And plugging all of those in is what will allow us to solve for k. So we will do just that. So from this, we will plug in 0.4 for n, leave k as it is, plug in 1.6 for the product of z and r, and then plug in 2.3 for the product of, or for the value of d. So now we're just trying to isolate k. So we multiply by 2.3, And then we divide by 1.6. So we will just plug this directly into Desmos. All right, so uh, 0.4 times 2.3, all divided by 1.6, and that should work regardless. We get 0.575, so K. Okay is equal to 0 0.575. And that's all there is to it. We break out the eraser and we see that B is our answer. I'll work out at least one more of these types of problems. Feel free to check it out.